Welcome back, everybody. It's Jay, and you are still watching some Zero Time Dilemma. That's what we're still playing. That's what we're still doing. That's who we're still killing, is all of the characters. Now, all right, so last time, we did a bunch with Q-Team, but we saw a, a video that showed Junpei's head cut off and Akane and Carlos going at it with chainsaws and axes. And I believe that's this one. So we're going to get some answers right now. We're not even going to waste time. Boom. Go. Suspicion. This is... The pantry. Oh, hey, Carlos. Where's Junpei? No idea. He was already gone when I woke up. Oh, great. Oh, it's locked. Wait. So that one video had his dangerous. head already cut off. Has that happened already? Locked us in? It's been a long time since you've seen each other, right? Maybe now he's Zero's accomplice. That's not possible. The Junpei I know would never do something like that to us. Yes, but you already admitted the Junpei you know Sorry. isn't the guy we've been one of the dealing with. Junpei. You know, this has been on my mind for a while. But what exactly is he to you, Akane? It's hard to believe that you two just knew each other in grade school. Junpei, he's very... Yes, he's very important to me. Oh, wow, that really answered it. All my life, I've never really had many friends to call my own. That's surprising. I would have taken you as the type guys and girls all fawn over in Japan. Oh, you're very kind. Thank you. But that's not exactly... Junpei always said... I was a girl who always said what shouldn't be said. I never found myself bullied or anything. But it still seemed as if people considered me something of an odd girl. Junpei was because you spoke your mind? He told me he'd rush to my aid whenever I was troubled. Once, when we were young, I was crying over something and he faced the enemy alone. He sounds like he's a comic book hero. <laughs> yes. Or to a video me, game he hero. At the very Aww. least. Aww. But this past year has completely changed him. It seems to me like he's the exact opposite now. If it was because of me somehow, then this time I need to rush to his aid. That's what I've decided anyway. You really like Junpei, don't you? What in the world are you saying, Carlos? Oh, she's blushing. I'm out of my depth when it comes to romance. My co-workers do always come to me with their stories, though. So I can tell. Just by looking, I can tell if someone's in love. Does that mean there isn't anyone like that for you? That important? His sister. There is. I love my little sister very See? much. See? That sister complex. Sunshine on my life. Oh, so a sister complex. We have established ah, this. Ah, you're horrible. Were you not in Consider the uh, decontamination room? Now then, nothing will come from just sitting around here. How about we find a way out? Let's right. do it. I bet you're eager to see your dearest love as soon as you can. Oh, God, is his head already chopped off? What the? That's a hand. Oh, don't let that be a real hand. Don't let that be one of Junpei's hands. I don't like him. He's been a douche this whole time. Doesn't mean I want him dead. Oh, that's a real hand. Yeah, okay, so we've got the doll, a right arm, and weird markings on the glass. They almost look like, uh, was it Kanji or whatever it is, the, the Japanese characters? I don't know what it is. Oh. How do you open the door? Incorrect. All right, so that was five inputs, so we're going to find five inputs. And of course, it's still locked. Bottle and a card. Okay. Is there a lock on each side? Oh, there is. Okay, so it's actually two different doors. So I might have to find two different codes. And four digits for this one. 
That's the number on my luggage. Yeah, Spaceballs reference. Error. Okay. Yeah, of course that number was going to be wrong. What the heck? Yeah, it kind of looks like a cookie cutter or cookie outline or something, but like, yeah, I don't know what... I don't know what to think too much of it. Second instance of microwaves. Um, just like paint cans and boxes and all this. Okay. Water and the mold. And oh, it's a jello mold. Kind of, yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess it does say gelatin right there. So, I have an odd feeling the gelatin mold will be going... Oh, my gosh. You say it's fake. Junpei wasn't wearing a jacket, though. He had a short sleeve shirt on. Oh, my God. Who had... Who had a jacket and pants, though? What is this over here? Is that nothing? I think it's nothing. Oh my god, did Eric have... Whoa. Left door, right door. Okay. Left door, right door. Potatoes. So that was the, are the potatoes gonna conduct electricity? Okay. So we've got gelatin, a knob. Does that knob work on this? Maybe. Yes, it does. Oh, okay, so I need to find, I need to find the actual mold then. Because that's just the gelatin. Um, there's the water probably to make it. See, there's that little thing hanging off right back here and... Nope, I thought maybe that was it. What's with the bar? That was it down here, right? They say nothing else special about it. I have an odd feeling there will be. How about up top, maybe? No. Oh, there's drawers down here. Oh my god. Oh, can we stop with the body? Is the other door open? No, okay. I'm gonna say the iodine on the potatoes. D U D L. Oh, down, up, down, left, left, right. Okay. So down, up, down, left, left, right. On. Left door, right door. Okay. So open up the left door is probably this one. Maybe. Let's try it. Let's find out. So. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Incorrect. Let's try the other door. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Okay, worked on that one. May oh, maybe the pattern goes the other way to open up the other door.
Oh, what the heck? Okay. So. Oh my gosh, do I really have to get this whole thing figured out? Okay, that seems good so far. Um, there's not really an orange there. Oh, there's an orange there though. Okay. That looks good, I think. Here's open. Check. Nice. One shot it. Go me. Is the cookie cutter mold or Jello mold? Sorry. Oh. I want to know what's up with all the pieces. That's got to be somebody. Not a big fan of that. Okay, so let's try the, the opposite way. So right, left, left, down, up, down. Okay. That's what they meant by left and right door. Bottle of water. So that's how we're going to make our jello mold. We should heat it up. Warm, cool. So it turns red, I guess, when you heat it up. So probably need to put it in, put that doll in the microwave. Okay. Whoa. Left hand plus doll equals. I'm sure that's going to come back to haunt me. Left hand. Well, that's the left hand. Left hand plus doll. Oh, maybe I need to heat up the doll and then put it with that. Because that was the left hand. Warm it up. One, two, three, four. I already did that. I tried that code already. It didn't work. I guess I can try it again, but... Let's... Well, alright, let's do other stuff first. Hold on. Okay, so we combine... Hold on. Nope, don't care. Alright, so now we combine that with this. Oh, hold on. Oh, do I need to maybe like throw it in the freezer? Maybe not. Okay. <laughs> what if I cook it? Oh, wait. We can change the temperature, huh? We can cool it. We have jello. And now we use jello in this thingy. And drawer from below the machine. Now he's gonna have something in his hands. Ew. Why are we just randomly grabbing body parts? Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> he wants us to play rock, paper, scissors. It's cold. Oh, do I have to put the arm in the microwave? Because it said it's cold and it's got its hand balled up. There's got to be something in his hand. He did say it's a fake. I don't really think it's fake, though. Heating up caused the hand to open. Okay. Can I use the key on this one? Oh, what the hell? Five, two, nine. Okay. Oh, it could be right upside down, too. So that would be, what, 625, right? So, is that what it would be? 625? Am I right with that? Maybe I'm wrong. Can, we, can I have them give each other five? So then is there nothing with the foot? Okay. Oh, Juan. Okay, maybe that's nothing I can click on. I mean, I guess we're going back to that keypad. Not keypad, the number pad. Okay, but we had Okay, thing said 1, 2, 3, 4 Which we've tried already Okay, so we know that doesn't work Maybe So that will help. Oh, doll. Was it doll plus hand? Or left hand plus doll. Yeah, left hand plus doll. So it is. Well, we got okay. If it was upside down, <clears throat> so five, so that'd be like it's one, two, three, four. Okay, so then. Oh, hold on, wait. So that'd be one, eight, five, nine. Look at that. I forgot all about that message. And then let me guess. Uh, is there about to be a whole person in here? Well, not a whole person, but part of a person. It's Junpei's head. No! I I don't think this is fake. I really think that the passwords are bold at this point. So I've got like 15 written down. This room is locked. So the one who killed Junpei is Carlos. What would make him think that she did it? 
Well, okay, good. He's going after the door. Damn it! Damn it! Break, damn you! Uh, uh, Connie? I was gonna say, you knew she was going after the door after they already tried to pull that bait and switch. <gasps> but now they've got weapons. to get that $500,000. If only I could save her. Just save Maria. It's all I wanted. And now... I mean, well, according to their rules, though, they had to kill each other. For example... So if somebody else is killing these people off when they do all these things, like with Mira and Junpei, wouldn't they be breaking the rules? I mean, I know it's kind of hard to say breaking the rules for some shady people that kidnap, you know, nine people and put them in this death game, but still. speed slows down, of course. It's not much better than if the computer had froze. What's happening with your younger sister is similar. So you're saying this isn't carbon monoxide poisoning, but... Right. With Maria, her brain and nervous system seem to be perfectly fine. Couldn't figure out the cause until now. Other patients with the same symptoms began appearing recently. And they have. Reverie syndrome. A variety so that's of the second time we've heard this brought up now. Out of the mind, as if one was constantly dreaming. That's why it's called the daydream or reverie syndrome. There have been no complete recoveries. As of yet. However, it seems with the newest medical technology, a few cases have been successful at relieving the symptoms. Then please, you must do the same for her. Does little Maria have insurance? Really, we're going the medical you insurance route? You understand what's required for treatment, yes? If I did, she'll... Maria will... So that means I... I absolutely can't die here. That's why you killed Junpei, isn't it? What? What did what? you say? You figured you needed to kill someone to save your sister. And that's why you... Have you flipped your Whoa, lid, what, lady? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb! Did you forget that you and I are the only ones in this ward? So it's obvious the killer is the dog it who's getting out of there. You, the dog was out. <laughs> and now you've ruined a perfectly Connie, good cell phone. Down. I am calm. Yeah, that's calm. Okay, you're right. I'm the only other one here. But I. Oh no! It was definitely you who killed him. Wait! Stop! Say that, but maybe you're the one who really did it. What did you say? You were the one who killed Junpei. And now, you're going totally nuts with that chainsaw. I don't believe this. No matter what, even if the world went topsy-turvy this very second, I'd... Well, I'm pretty confident she's going to get him in the arm, because I know in that one... Next one. Kill, video huh? you see his arm kind of messed up if two more people die you can return to your darling little sister hey now if you kill me your probability of escape gets pretty high what, what the hell why'd 
she run away? Did she feel too threatened by me with this axe? Think. Calmly, think it over again. It's just like any other Code 3. Once 90 minutes are up, an injector in your bracelet will activate. An anesthetic and an agent to erase your memories will be administered. Okay. So after we voted at 1330, we were hit with the anesthetic. We awoke in the pantry after 1800. It's four hours of time not accounted for. What was I doing during that time? Was I really sound asleep then, or... I just can't remember what happened. How come every time you wake up, it's right after 1800? Except for the very last one. Maybe Connie was right, and I... What? Blackout? No, Akani had run off towards control. It might be possible to turn off the lights there. So she did kill Junpei? And she's coming for me. I don't know, I'm not picturing either one of them killing him. I'm picturing her flipping out though. What the hell should I do? Oh, this is this first decision time? Killing her or not? Think calmly, rationally. Who is the most threatening person here right now? Whoever it was who killed Junpei. So what I need to do is remove that person. Even if it ends up being me. No. What the hell am I thinking? There's no way it could be me. So then, then, Ah, there you are. Damn it. Well, you already knew where he so was. Oh, so my choice is basically going to be between me and Akane. You know what? We're going to do something different. <laughs> they were ready for that. How would the dog do it? Try zero. Oh, whoops. We're going villain first before we start naming off ourselves, even though I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, do I really have to choose between them? All right, we're going Akane first. I don't think she really did it, though. gonna kill you though oh oh well we knew that she got his arm because yeah because this is what we saw in that video he sliced her in the neck This would also mean now he doesn't fall asleep. Oh, I knew it. You. No. I didn't kill. Junpei. I'm sorry. I couldn't avenge you. Akane? I. I just killed. Like I said, that means he can't fall back asleep, though, which means he's now awake for the next, you know, six hours, which we know they fall asleep through. Oh, really? There's no kind of into it. What is this one? That's weird. All right. So let's go the other route. Carlos 
You killed Junpei. What if I put in Junpei? What if Junpei killed Junpei? My gosh, move up. Oh, you can't go all the way across. Okay. Carlos! So does he kill himself? Of course. Akane. She'd never do something like that to Junpei. He's very... Yes. He's very important to me. If that's the case, then I'm... I'm the only one who could have killed him. It might have been a demon possessing me. Or maybe it was some kind of parasite. Or I'm under hypnosis? Whatever it was, I'm... Regardless of the reason, I was the... And then I forgot I did it because of the damn amnesia drug. Carlos? Don't come any closer. I'm dangerous. My body moves against my will. I might kill you next. If that's how it is, then... <gasps> Carlos, no! Wait, what? <laughs> oh, he's gonna slice himself. I still don't think either one did it. Why did this happen? Uh, uh, Mom. Dad. I won't let anyone die. Somebody's messing with them. I guarantee it. Game over. So you don't even get passcodes for those two. Oh, we're saving as always. So is that it? That no, that's not complete then. So how do you unlock this one? Because that was just a cinematic. That's just a cinematic. I'm so confused. But anyways, all right. So there's um Ah. <sighs> there's craziness. That was uh what was it suspicion. And apparently it's not complete. There's still one more branch to it, and I'm not quite sure how to get there yet. So we'll have to figure that out down the road. But there we go. And June pay dead, at least in this timeline or However you want to set it up, flow. Akane dead in one, Carlos dead in one. Craziness all over. So I think next time we're going back to the, uh I think we're going back to Team D. And we'll get them caught up and see what's going on. Maybe we'll figure out who's this branch here. Maybe I'll I'll look specifically for this one and we'll finish off this. But there we go. Alright, another session done. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope uh, everybody is enjoying the series. Comment, like, subscribe, all that stuff if you want to, and I will see you in the next one.